We all throw out trash, and much of it gets incinerated. It's a fact we can't escape, but now a new small, smokeless incinerator is making its way across Asia. For just $30,000, its creators say it's perfect for apartments and hospitals. The Wall Street Journal's Ramian Asensio takes a peek at this year's Eco Expo Asia. Where there's smoke, there's fire, right? Well, at least until today. That's because this incinerator is no ordinary smoke belcher. This trash burner touts new technology from Japan that makes steam but no smoke and that's better for our health. Katsuhiro Arai, GM of InterAsia, which represents the Chua Star incinerator in Hong Kong, explains. This incinerator uh, burns uh, carbon completely and then combine with uh, oxygen and then make a CO2. This is the most uh, different point uh, compared with other incinerator. Everybody can use without a special skill. First, waste, including plastic, wood, or tires, is thrown in the fire. The on button gets punched, then the fire gets going, while water pumped inside the shell keeps it from getting too hot. The fan pulls the air into the second chamber. Ash gets sucked down, filtered air rises out. Now, is it safe for me or for you to put your face over that exhaust? Of course, can. And for how long? How long? Oh, not all day, uh, a few minutes. And other shortfalls exist. This incinerator doesn't produce electricity, while others can. And incinerators still leave ash behind. With Hong Kong expected to run out of landfill in the next few years, that is a problem. Still, against the backdrop of Hong Kong's hazy air that you can see across Victoria Harbour, smokeless incinerators do have at least a small place in this city to make our air just a little bit cleaner and to make our sights just a little bit clearer. And the city needs it. For the first half of 2013, Hong Kong's air pollution exceeded World Health Organization guidelines at every single monitoring station except one, according to Hong Kong's Clean Air Network. Pollutants include sulfur dioxide, nitrogen dioxide, ozone, and particulate matter less than 2.5 microns in diameter. All those led to more than 1,600 premature deaths, more than 3.5 million extra doctor visits, and nearly $2.5 billion lost, according to Hong Kong's Headley Environmental Index. The time is right for smokeless incineration, says Arai. Hong Kong citizens, Chinese people also, they have a concern about the air pollution. So this time we would like to contribute to prevent the air pollution more in Hong Kong air. And demand for cleaner air also lies in mainland China, just about 20 miles to the north with all of its countless industrial factories. Now, Chua Star says it's only sold three smokeless incinerators to date. That means they're going to be needing a lot more of those, and we are going to be needing a lot more of these. In the meantime,